Okay, so if you looked at the calendar today, you know it's February 29th. We don't see it that often, leap day. So that day obviously only comes around once every four years. And if it's your birthday, are you one year older or four years older? The answer really depends on who you ask. Gins 5 Sarah Duran explains. At North Central Baptist Hospital, a baby is born every day. We probably have between 10 and 20 babies on any given day at North Central Baptist. Dr. Ritu Dutta is an OBGYN. She says leap day is no different, but the odds of being born today are high. That comes one in 1,461 days, so the odds are pretty rare. The rare date comes with a unique title. Those born today are called leapers. The nickname was given to Tristan Elizondo and four other infants at the hospital on leap day in 2020. And four years before that, hospital records show a total of 15 leapers were born. I was born in uh, 2000. That's the year Adrian Arevalo was born over at Methodist Hospital. Today, he turns 24 years old, but in leap years, that means... It'll be my sixth uh, real birthday that I've had. It's been funny. I definitely always get jokes. Jokes aside, Arevalo is often asked when he celebrates his birthday on a non-leap year. I'll do March 1st. Dr. Dutta says babies born on February 29th do have the date listed on their birth certificates. So legal documents are not a problem for a Revelo. What is? For websites that request your birthday, they usually ask that you put the month and then the day and then the year. So I'll do February. I'll click 29 and it'll change to 28. So that's just a funny facet of daily life, I guess. But on this day, Leapers rule all 5 million worldwide of you. And that number was provided by the History Channel. And guys, with 5 million leapers, leaplings in the world, I did not know a single one until I met Adrian the other day. Crazy, right, Sarah? Barry? Do Same you know here. anyone born? No. No. <laughs> no never I met to, one. I thought I about this. I thought about this earlier. I don't think I know anyone. Yeah, but Sarah, now you can officially say you do because right? of that story. <laughs> I have one friend. They are the rarest of them all. There you go.